Hello everyone and welcome to my channel. This is Lena and I hope that you're having a great time wherever you are. So I'm back with another reading. This is going to be a candle wax reading. For any personal sessions, you can check the description box of the video. Details would be there. On my community section, I have made a post regarding which topic you want me to do next. So in case you haven't yet voted, you can go ahead and check that. Also, this is going to be a general message or collective reading wherein there is no bar on the topic. Whatever comes out will be the message. And uh, if something doesn't resonate with you, feel free to leave that and these readings are always timeless no matter whenever you come across the video messages would apply so i am already getting a message that some of you need to be careful while you are on road you might end up getting into an accident again i'm not here to trigger anyone but that's the message i got right when i was starting your reading be a little careful while you're on the road okay So let's see your reading. Wow. Right from the get-go, the flame is very strong. I already see... Ouch! Okay. This is the second time I'm burning my finger or my hand. Like I'm almost about to burn my finger. This is the second time before I was starting your reading. Once and now again. <laughs> Be careful with something. Okay, in the flame, okay, what I was trying to say, I forgot, um, but now I got it again. So in the flame, I was seeing the image of Goddess Kali's weapon. It gave me the feeling of a khada, uh, which is Kali's weapon. So I'm getting a feeling that, um, okay. The flame is very... Okay, so I'm getting the feeling or I'm getting the message that seven forms of goddesses are blessing you or seven forms of goddesses are around you. I specifically got seven forms. So the divine feminine is coming across to you or the divine feminine is blessing you in seven different forms. I feel someone is strongly connected to the energy of dogs like I'm getting Anubis Anubis could be the energy you really can equip <clears throat> or Hades um, I'm also getting a feeling that mm, you get a lot of signs through um, wait what is that do you look at that I mean <laughs> Uh, for many of you, I feel snake is your spirit animal right now. And I'm also getting a feeling that when you see, when you start seeing a lot of snakes, take it as a sign that some kind of wisdom is pouring into you or some kind of knowledge, like something, 
something important is about to be revealed to you sorry um like i feel this symbolism is linked to some kind of wisdom or knowledge the symbolism of snakes okay um okay let's move to the other side i get a feeling some of you you make offering with a spoon to a god goddess or to a deity like i got the image of someone making an offering with a spoon so it's very much appreciated and i feel that to whosoever you're making that offering to whichever god goddess deity they really like it they're acknowledging it in my mind i'm getting the image of a grasshopper um and i'm also getting a feeling with that grasshopper that many of you underestimate yourself when it comes to something but you don't know how powerful you are or your actions can make a lot of difference this is the kind of message i'm getting you're underestimating yourself with something in life but or you think that doesn't matter whatever i'm doing it's not given it's not even mattering you know it it doesn't matter but you don't know how how much of an impact you create okay say for example um let me give you an example okay like say for example you um, you have a youtube channel okay let me give an example like that and you don't get a, for for now maybe you don't get a lot of views uh, on your channel or something like that but even though if you're getting like 100 200 views so that is still creating an impact inside a lot of people so you don't realize it see at the end of the day if your work or your um contribution creates something good even in one person's life i think you are successful okay even if for example if something you are doing makes you feel happy at the end of the day doesn't matter how others are taking it or not you are successful already success is not measured by numbers success is not measured by there is no definition yes there is a definition i if i go by the materialistic side of it but at the end of the day i feel you are doing something that is still creating an impact don't think that you are not creating an impact or don't think that your contribution is going unnoticed it's not like that for many of you this could also imply that you are doing some kind of spiritual practice or you are you are following certain thing in your routine and you feel that is it even making any difference or you have been doing it for a while but you think no it's not creating a difference but you don't see it yet on your physical world but it is creating a difference okay so you need to keep on doing what you're doing it is creating a difference maybe you're not noticing uh, like it may not be coming as a big notice yet but it will so keep doing what you're doing wow that was a big one <laughs> um i'm also getting a feeling that you need to speak less i'm getting a feeling maybe um right now your power would be to keep quiet that's the kind of message i got your power will be to shut your mouth i don't know <laughs> what i'm getting why i'm getting but i literally got as if uh you need to keep quiet that will be your power move so say for example if someone is trying to provoke you to say something better keep quiet you don't have to answer back or someone is doing something intentionally and you know that that person is wrong like something i'm getting you know your power will be to keep quiet like you shouldn't be uttering a word and that's how you will make a power move just by keeping quiet okay is it's focusing wow today you know when i was speaking all that i i was focusing at somewhere else i was not looking at this and today the wax is concentrated at one place you know what this feeling like what this gave me the feeling like today the wax is not scattered a lot this is giving me a feeling that you're slowly coming back to your source or you're slowly like your life is not going to be as much distributed and chaotic as it used to be your life is a lot coming together 
um, like going forward you're going to notice that you know you're not having a lot of scattered energy rather your energy is very much focused on certain things or only on some priority items um, you, you will be able to focus your energy a lot only on important things you're learning how to uh, or universe is allowing you with resources so that you know you're able to concentrate only on the important things small things won't matter anymore you know it's much more concentrated i love this energy i'm also getting a message here that someone misses the way you smell like someone really like you know um, when someone remembers you obviously this is someone you're not in contact with this person specifically remembers the way you smell like that's the main catch that's the main memory about you for this person like they really miss the way you smell i'm also getting the image of a cow like for some reason this gave me the feeling of a cow cow spirit is very like if I talk in terms of animal spirit or the animal totem, cows represent a very motherly energy. Cow represents nurturing energy. So I'm getting a feeling here that um, like people around you see, see you as someone who is very nurturing, like you take good care of things or you are very sensible like you're very sensitive and very nurturing kind of a person like that's how people see you when they even if the strangers uh they see you for the first time that's the kind of vibe you throw off <clears throat> someone is really okay no Okay. I'm getting someone is <laughs> someone is shopping for like their let's not go there, let it be. <laughs> okay. I'm getting the image of that uh, what is that um, a soft toy that that says hello kitty I'm getting the image of that for some reason um, why am I getting Oh, okay. I'm getting a feeling if someone gives you a soft toy, don't take it. Uh, especially if a feminine energy gives you a soft toy, don't take it. Let this settle for a couple of seconds and we are going to see what that is. Wow, it's all clean only this... Um... I don't know 
I'm like, what? I'm getting weird. <laughs> I'm getting something related to a scorpion feminine like uh, maybe a female or a feminine around you again uh, especially if this person is a Scorpio I feel you need to be a little careful with this person if they bring some kind of gift or something for you maybe you should not be taking it or <laughs> I don't know like they have some kind of nasty intention I'm getting you need to be careful with this person. It's still a bit hot, but I'm going to take it. What is that? <laughs> okay. That fall off. Um, wait. You tell me what do you see in this? This is like, um, I forgot that animal's name. Is it, uh, what is that called? Wow, I forgot, but I remember how it looks. It's giving me the image, but I don't know the name or right now I, I'm not able to recall the name. You guys let me know what do you see in this image? So this will be it from my end. I hope you enjoyed the reading and I'm going to see you again on my channel. Bye-bye.